You probably know Emily Hampshire from her star-making turn as Stevie Bud in one of the most successful TV shows of all time, talking about Schitt's Creek. Since then, Emily has not slowed down. She's appeared in movies and TV series, become an author, hosted a pandemic talk show, and has multiple writing and producing projects now in development. And now you can see her in her latest work, The End of Sex, a film about a happily married couple who attempts to revive their sex life when their daughters go away to sleepaway camp, even considering a possible threesome. Take a look. I thought this was like every man's fantasy. Oh, yeah, yeah, in, in theory. Oh, my gosh. I, I should be getting a medal for this. This is like me being the best wife on the planet. Sorry, it's, just, it's, it's too much pressure. It looks fun. <laughs> I, I'm really excited to see this. Emily Hampshire joins us now. Uh, and welcome to the show. Thank you. So before we talk about the movie, let's just talk about you've had an extraordinary run with Schitt's Creek. What have you been doing in the past few years, professionally, personally? I mean, after Schitt's Creek, well, a lot more opportunities mm. opened up. And so I've just been I've, I've been lucky enough to not stop working mm -hmm. um and i've gotten the opportunity to uh, opportunity to like create my own stuff um so that's basically what i've been doing and so it really i mean you started with Schitt's creek in 2015 have you changed your outlook or who you work with or the projects that you take on at this point well i think what's changed is that i have choice now like yeah. when you're starting out as an actor i mean i've been an actor since i was 12 but um before you're known you just want to get work any work really um so now i i get sent stuff that's better quality stuff i want to do i can say no to things mm -hmm. which is nice um yeah so tell us about the end of sex i mean it's an intriguing subject mm -hmm. uh, the the title I I itself you play emma husband is josh tell us more well, um, they're a married couple, like most married couples, uh, who've been together for a long time and have been paying attention to the kids, and the kids go off to camp, and they think they're just going to do it in every room in the house. And they realize, oh, that spark is gone. And so they then spend the next week um, having some sexual adventures to try and rekindle that spark. Um, Things go, I mean, they have a threesome, like you said, it doesn't go well. Uh, they try the ecstasy, that doesn't go well either. So they do a lot of things. And your co-star, the director, you guys all had worked together 10 years prior on My Awkward Sexual Adventure. Yes. So what is it? Is it the topic? Is that the thing like, <laughs> that just, you know, gets you going? Well, it's so I I met Jonas Chernick, who's the lead and uh, writer of this, and Sean Garrity on that film. Um, and it was a movie about what you, the kind of sex you have in your 20s. And then... Ten years later, um, Jonas had been married and has kids, and I'd been married, and you just find yourself in a different place. And he he wrote the script and sent it to me, and I was like, this is amazing. I thought it was so funny and so well written. What drew you to this role? Uh, the script, but also I would do anything with Sean and Jonas. Um, but then when I read the script, I was like, I would even do this without you guys. It's so good. Amelia Airwood, Basic Witch. This is your new graphic novel. Tell us about that. It's my baby. Um, so it's a graphic novel, and it's about Amelia, who is the black sheep of her famous witch family. They're, um, they have a reality show, not unlike the Kardashians. And uh, she is cut out of the reality show because her magic is just a little off brand. She's a basic witch, like she's bad at magic. So But you were actually inspired to write it by the Kardashians, is that right? Yes, I was. <laughs> I yes, I was watching the Kardashians. I was. And I was like, this is this is a real family. Like they are actual sisters. And so I was thinking, what if I just happened to be born into this family? I would be the worst Kardashian ever. Like I would get stuck in the waist trainer, they would kick me <laughs> off the show, and that's where Amelia was born. Uh, I was just like, who is that other sister that nobody knows about because she's such a bad influencer? <laughs> What's next? Oh boy, um, well, I'm going off to Scotland to the second season of The Rig, which is a show I do on Amazon. Um, yeah, I go off very soon.
Well, we thank you so much for dropping by and looking forward certainly to seeing this new movie. Emily Hampshire is in and stars in The End of Sex. It is out in theaters this Friday. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.